So we're going to play with tags. Tags.hawksy.info. This is our cool little tool for looking at uh, Twitter data for a particular hashtag and seeing what comes up. So I'm going to choose this, which is version 6.1. Make a copy. It's going to create a Google Sheet. Okay. So just going to do put a hashtag in LTHE chat. Gonna leave it default so it'll do actually let's set it for we can set it for default which is seven days, last seven days. Let's set it for, yeah, well, let's leave it for the last seven days. That's default. So what you get is a new little tab up here, menu option. And when we press run now, it's going to try and link us to Twitter. Mine's already set up on Twitter, so you, but you do have to authorize it. Um, I'm quite happy. It's up to you whether you go ahead with it. If you haven't done one of these before, it will try and uh, you have to get permission and do, do some more work. Okay, I'm just going to call that LTHE chat. Okay. So the next thing we can do is we can start collecting. Well, it's already done it. That's what I did here. That's a lot of tweets. You need to make it, at the moment, it's only private. So only I can see it. You need to make it so that anyone with a link can do it. So you just change the settings there. That enable that means we can do we can get the graphical stuff in a minute. Okay, so you just change it. And now it's time to get the pretty picture. So you go to Tags Explorer, you then get this URL appearing. And we get our pretty picture. So this is replies down the bottom right of the screen you've got two other options you can put you can also add mentions in so you get this more dotted line and you can see there's more connections so these people are mentioning these and you can also then put retweets in So we're now getting people who've retweeted what other people, what people have, what, well, obviously re retweeting what people have already said. Some really cool little things you can do. Let's choose a node. And what you can then do is see how over that, well, this is actually uh, seven days. How the connections were forming. And we're, we're going to expect quite a big jump. Lots more connections, I hope. Here, here we go. OK, 
Okay. We can get who's posted the most during that time. And then top conversation lists is a mixture of posts, who's posted and also who's been replied to and mentioned. Okay, we can come out of that. One of the other nice little tools is, well, two actually. We can add a summary sheet and, and a dashboard. So let's add the summary first. What it does is create a new tab here. You have to turn it on. And you can see what kind of activities is happening overall. Archive, you can get to it through there for that link, or it's actually one of the tabs at the bottom. That, that gives you all the tweets during that time period. If I come back to here for dashboard, again, I have to It gives you a sense of over that time, you know, what was going on. So on the 17th, there was low, there was 1,011 tweets during the day, dropping off to 146 the next day, 41. And that's not particularly surprising for LTHE check because that's on a Wednesday. And that's really it.